The Professional Fighters League season comes to a climax with the biggest night in MMA, the 2019 PFL World Championship. New Year's Eve in New York City as Madison Square Garden plays host to six world title fights, all in one action-packed evening of intense competition. Drops him with a body shot. Fighters earned their way to the title fights by competing in the regular season to qualify for the playoffs. There, the men survived two opponents in one night of frenetic action to advance to these championship bouts. Tonight's six title winners are crowned PFL World Champion and awarded $1 million. It's the PFL's innovative format that put each of the title contenders in control of their own fate to deliver them this life-altering opportunity. And that's enough! The championship action is about to unfold on PFL Inside the Season. PFL Inside the Season is presented by the United States Marine Corps. Five men's division titles and the first ever women's world lightweight championship are at stake. Kayla Harrison, undefeated at 6-0, is on a quest to establish herself as the best in the world. The back-to-back -back Olympic judo gold medalist finds herself in a rematch with her toughest opponent yet, Brazilian Larissa Pacheco, the only fighter to take Harrison a full three rounds. Nice by Kayla. Pacheco claims she learned much from their first encounter and plans to apply it in the five-round championship bout. Ray Cooper III, 2018 championship runner-up, overcame regular season adversity in the form of a crushing KO to then stage a comeback in the playoffs and score an impressive KO victory of his own. Oh that win punched his ticket back to New York for a second consecutive shot at the welterweight title against newcomer David Mashaw, who felt the agony of defeat in his season opener and then went 3-0. A heavy hitter in his own right, Mashad isn't afraid to stand and trade. He's sure of one thing. No way this title fight goes five rounds. 2018 featherweight champ Lance the Party Palmer and 2018 lightweight champ Natan Schult are both vying for back-to-back -back PFL world titles. Palmer finds himself in a trilogy fight with submission specialist Alex Gilpin and Schult faces a powerful and relentless PFL newcomer, Tajikistan's Luik Rajabov. Sean O'Connell, the 2018 light heavyweight champ, is safely stationed cage side. So there will be no back-to-back -back title contenders in the light heavyweight division. Jordan Johnson was the lone American to qualify for the light heavy playoffs, where he advanced over Maxime Grishin, the only man to ever beat him and eliminated Rashid Yusupov, one of the four Russians dominating the division. Johnson, a wrestler, will see a familiar face in the smart cage. He and Argentinian Emiliano the He-Man Sordi trained together for a few years. Sordi, in his second PFL season, breezed through the competition, winning all four of his fights by stoppage, three coming in the first round. Another first round knockout for Emiliano Sordi. It was a breakout year for the 28-year-old striker who looks to fulfill his goal of being the first Argentinian to win a major MMA title. First title bout of the evening. First of six in the biggest night in mixed martial arts. Early on, Sordi used his striking ability to control Johnson. Nice one-two there for Emiliano Sordi. Johnson attempted to apply his grappling skills went for a single leg, but could not complete the takedown. Nice right hand there from Sorty. Johnson in trouble. Johnson fighting for the super low single here, ducking his head inside and out of the low leg of Emiliano Sorty, trying to avoid those Johnson's hammer turns. I believe Johnson's, Johnson's hurt in here. trouble. Emiliano Sorty pouring it off from the top. Jordan Johnson turning. 